I think we're coming at together at a, a really important moment. Uh, English learners have have grown in uh, just in in, in uh, prominence, uh, not just in the usual states, but around, across the country. This conference is important because usually um, English language learners are an afterthought uh, for the work, and um, this conference actually brings together. Uh, the researchers and the practitioners, and also works in tandem with the developers of the Common Core to address the needs of English language learners. This is a great opportunity to really hit the reset button um, for many of our kids, right, and for many of our schools. As we are thinking and discussing and um, debating with one another this morning and for the days to come, Remember that the end result of this is the practice piece and the implementation piece, and this stuff has to work at the ground level. You know, I have a school, a high school that has 72 beginning level one students that they just received this year. What do you do with those kids? I and mean, how, what kind of instruction needs to take place? And how does that look? Um, because it obviously does have to look different. Our paper examines sources of complexity in texts and asks, how can we make sure that English learners and language minority students are not left out of this curricular upgrade? Working closely with such texts is about the only way students can learn such language. If the kids can't handle the language, how do they get access to the content? I mean, what are you teaching if the kids don't know what you're talking about? What I want to say to this audience is that the first step in addressing the needs of English learners in mathematics is to ensure that they have teachers who were trained to teach math for understanding. There's as big of a demand for change in the type and level of classroom discourse in the next generation science as there is in the language arts and math in Common Core. That's where this language opportunity lies, right? Because this course is a place where you learn language. We need to build the expertise of every teacher so that every teacher does not separate language from content, from skills, from belonging, from being, from doing, from acting. Language is part of the content courses. It's not a reason to have students tracked into some, something else. Discussions are a big part of what we want to see in the classrooms. If it's done with attention to the participation and inclusion, it could be the greatest thing that's happened. Language is not only a way into the content. Language, in part, is the content. There is the language of science. There is the language of mathematics. This is important for all kids, but it's especially important for our English learners. I think this is a magic moment. A magic moment to try to think about how do we think about language, how do we define language, how do we make certain that we're consistent